Rowland. Hi. Hi, I'm Natalie Clark. I'm one of the physician assistant students working with the physician assistant that will be taking care of you today. Do you care if I ask you a few questions and examine you? No. Can you verify your date of birth for me, please? Mm -hmm. October 25th, 1995. Okay. And what brings you into the ER today? I'm here because I have this weird rash on my leg. Mm -hmm. When did you notice this rash? About two days ago. Okay. Has anything, have you tried anything to make it worse or improve? No. I, I just put this cream on it. It's like, I think it's a cortisone cream. Uh -huh. It's a little itchy, but it didn't really do anything. Okay. Um, do you recall anything that may have, you may have been bitten by or would have triggered this rash? Um, I did go hiking last week. I don't know if that had anything to do with it. Okay. Do you have similar rash elsewhere? Is it just on your leg? It's just on my leg. Can you describe the rash a little for me? Um, it's just kind of like red. It's like a little like circle here. There's a, like something in the middle, so I guess maybe that's what ever bit me. And it kind of like it's warm when you touch it. Okay, that's good. Have you had any rashes like this in the past? No. Okay. Um, is there anything else associated with this rash? Um, I've been feeling like really tired lately. I don't know if that has anything to do with it. Okay. Um, have you had any fevers? I did have like a little fever yesterday. Okay. Um, have you noticed any, like you said you were a little bit fatigued, but otherwise you haven't noticed any like weight changes, weight loss, weight gain? No. Any rashes? You said no rashes elsewhere. Mm -hmm. Have you seen any lumps or bumps or um, sores anywhere else? No. Any itching no. or dry skin? No, not really. Okay. Any change in color other than the redness to your skin elsewhere? No. No change in nails or hair. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, have you checked your moles? Is that all the same? Yeah. Okay. Um, have you any headaches or lightheaded or dizziness? Mm, not really. Okay. Um, and you don't have history of this rash in the past? No. Okay. Um, is anyone in your family have this have a similar rash? Mm -mm. Um, any new um, like lotions that you use? Any exposures other than walking in the woods yeah that's fine yeah, I mean, but no no bug bites or anything no okay um on a daily basis do you take any medications um i just take birth control okay. um do you know the name of the birth control it's janelle p okay do you know the dose i just take it every day i'm okay. not sure all right and do you have any known allergies um i'm allergic to penicillin what's the reaction to i have a I'm gonna ask you a little bit about your past medical history now, including like your childhood up to now. Um, as a child, were you in generally good health? Or yeah, for the most part. No history of like chronic diseases like asthma or diabetes. Yeah. Okay. Um, as an adult, do you have any history of high blood pressure? No. Coronary artery disease? Mm -hmm. Diabetes? No. Um, cancer? No. Thyroid disorder? Kidney disease? Um, how about hepatitis? No. Or HIV? No. Um, any COPD or asthma? Have you had any surgeries in the past? No. How about, um, have you had any children? No. When was your last known menstrual period? Last week. And you're on oral contraceptives? Mm -hmm. Um, are you sexually active? Yes. With one or multiple partners? One. Okay, and you use safe sex precautions? Mm -hmm. Um, do you have any history, psychiatric history, any mental illness? No. Any any history of accidents or injuries? Um, I did dislocate my elbow in high school. Okay. How did you do that? I fell into a room. Okay. Did you have any treatment for it afterward? Um, I just had physical therapy. And no complications after that? Mm -mm. Cool. Um, are you up to date on your immunizations and routine screenings? Yeah. So you're up to date on your tetanus? your pertussis, mm -hmm. your diphtheria vaccine, mm -hmm. polio, um, PPD, I mean, not PPD, um, MMR, yeah. varicella, hep B, um, your annual flu vaccine, yep. um, Haemophilus flu B, mm -hmm. um, how about your meningococcal vaccine, yeah. HPV, mm -hmm. and herpes zoster. routine screenings, you, have you had a PPD? Yes. Tuberculosis screening. Uh, pap smear? Yes. Uh, 
How about a mammogram? No. Have you had a colonoscopy? Yes. For what reasoning? Um, I have IVF. Okay. Um, anything concerning on that? No. Okay. Uh, have you had fecal occult blood testing? No. And have you had your cholesterol checked? Yeah. Everything okay? Mm -hmm. I'm going to ask you a little bit your, about your family history. This includes your grandparents, your parents, and since you don't have kids, you don't have to worry about that, and your siblings. Uh, is there any history of high blood pressure in your family? Yeah. Who has high blood pressure? My grandfather. How about high cholesterol? Um, uh, coronary artery disease? Yeah. Who in your My grandfather. <laughs> Diabetes? Yeah. yeah. Grandfather. <laughs> uh, lung disease or asthma? How about tuberculosis? No. Um, any cancers in your family? Yeah. You do? My grandfather. Okay. What type of cancer did you? Lymphoma. Um, any history of kidney disease? No. Thyroid disorder? Mm -mm. Um, headaches? No. Seizure, dis seizure disorder? No. Any strokes in your family? Me and my grandma had strokes. Okay. Um, any history of arthritis? No. Um, is there any mental illness or suicide in your family? How about substance abuse? No. Um, do you have any genetically transmitted diseases? No. Um, any significant allergies that you're aware of in your family? No. And has anyone in your family presented with similar symptoms or a similar rash like you have today? Mm -hmm. wow. I'm going to ask you a little about your social life. Um, where were you born? In New Jersey. Okay. And how was your childhood? Good, bad? Yeah, it's good. Um, how many years of schooling have you completed? I completed college, so I'm grad. And what is your occupational history, past and present? Um, I work as an ER tech. Okay. And you're not retired yet. Um, how is your, what is your home situation? What type of home do you live in? I just live in a single family home with my mom and my dad, my brother. Okay, any pets? Yeah, two cats. <laughs> All right, is it um, safety up to, up to date? Yeah. Okay. Um, and what type of transportation do you typically use? I have a car. And what is your marital status or um, relationship status? Um, I'm not married, but I have a boyfriend. Okay. Um, are there any sources of stress in your life right now, over the past six months, throughout your life? Oh, cool. <laughs> okay. Um, have you been in the military at all? No. How is your financial situation? What do you do for leisure? How do you enjoy your free time? Just go outside, hiking. Okay. Cool. Do you have any religious or spiritual beliefs? I mean, I'm Christian. Okay. Um, do you exercise? I try to. Okay. Maybe how often? Well, Hopefully. a week. Okay. <laughs> what type of exercise do you like? I try to go to the gym. Maybe some yoga every once in a while. Okay. Yoga will help with the stress. Yeah. It's good. Um, what's your usual daily food intake? Um, I normally try to have like an equal balance. I have like each meal. Okay. Try to keep it healthy. Okay. Not always, but try. Okay. And your daily fluid intake? I have normally about like one or two water bottles of it. Okay. And your daily caffeine intake? Normally just like one cup of coffee. How are your sleep habits? So good. No trouble no sleeping? Nope. Okay. <laughs> Um, when it comes to safety, do you wear your seatbelt while driving? Of course. If you're riding a bike, do you typically wear a helmet? No. Okay. Probably should, but it's okay. Um, do you use sunscreen when you're out in the sun? Yeah. Okay. Um, and what is your sexual orientation? I am a trans female. Okay. Do you use any alternative healthcare practices? I do not. And do you feel safe in your Ask this to everyone. Um, any tobacco, alcohol, or drug use? Um, I occasionally drink alcohol. Okay. How many times? Like once weekly. A week. Okay. What's your choice of drink? Alcohol. <laughs> 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 um, preferably wine. Okay. One glass. Yeah. Okay. I like and have you ever smoked? Um, do you use any illegal drugs? No. Have you ever? No. Do you use any drugs not prescribed to you? Mm -hmm. Have you ever taken more of a medication that is prescribed to you? No. Good. Um, so 
So this next part of the history may feel like 100,000 questions, but I just want to make sure that I didn't miss anything. Um, I'm going to start head to toe. Okay. You recently said you've been feeling a little bit fatigued, maybe because of the rash, you don't know. Um, any, no recent weight loss? No. No change in clothing if it doesn't fit more tight or loose? No. Okay. Any fevers or chills? No. Um, you have that rash, but any itching, dryness, changes in color elsewhere? Any lumps or sores? No. Any change in your hair or nails? Change in size or color of your moles? No. Have you any headaches or a dizziness or lightheadedness? <laughs> no. Um, any recent head injuries? No. Um, how's your vision? No. Normal vision? Don't wear glasses or contacts? No. Contact lenses? Um, any pain, redness, or excessive tearing in your eyes? Mm -hmm. Any double or blurred vision? No. Have you seen any spots, specks, or flashing lights? No. Any history of glaucoma or cataracts? And how's your hearing? Vertiginous symptoms, any like spitting or mm -mm. any recent ear infections, ear aches, or discharge from your ears? Mm -hmm. okay. And you don't wear hearing aids? No. Uh, have you had any cold recently? No. Nasal congestion, um, discharge from your nose, itchiness, hay fever, any nosebleeds, and any sinus trouble recently? Um, any recent sore throats? teeth or gum issues, any bleeding from your gums, um, and you don't wear dentures. No. Any sore tongue, dry mouth, okay. Um, have you had any recent pain or stiffness in your neck? No. Any lumps or swollen glands? No. Any goiter? Okay. Um, do you usually do self-breast examinations? I don't. Okay. Um, but for the most part, you haven't been had any pain or discomfort or no. noticed any lumps, mm -hmm. any nipple discharge? No. Um, how's your breathing been? Normal. No recent cough or sputum? No. Um, any shortness of breath or wheezing? Mm -hmm. Any pain with inspiration, deep breath? No. Um, do you have any history of asthma, bronchitis, emphysema, pneumonia, tuberculosis? No. Have you ever required a chest x-ray? No. Um, do you have any heart trouble? Do you have any high blood pressure, history of high blood pressure, rheumatic fever, heart murmur, any recent chest pain, palpitations, or shortness of breath over the past six months? No. Um, do you need to use pillows to ease your breathing at night? No. Or sleep upright to help breathe? Mm -hmm. um, have you noticed any swelling in your hands, feet, or legs? Mm -hmm. <laughs> have you required any cardiac testing in the past or EKGs? No. Um, any recent GI symptoms? No. No trouble swallowing, heartburn, change in appetite, no nausea or vomiting? No. Um, any abdominal pain? Any change in bowel movements? Normal, bit, bowel movements have been normal in color and size. Mm -hmm. um, have you noticed any pain with bowel movements? No. Any blood or dark and tarry stools? Mm -mm. Any constipation or diarrhea? Uh, do you have any history of hemorrhoids? No. Um, Recent food intolerance or excessive belching or passing gas? No. Have you noticed your skin to appear a little more yellow? No. So no history of liver or gallbladder problems? No. Um, have you had recent leg pain or cramps upon exertion? No. Do you have any varicose veins? No. Any history of blood clots in your legs or no. extremities? Um, and you said no to swelling in your calves, legs, or feet. Um, have you noticed any change in color in your fingertips or toes? No. Um, have you noticed any swelling with redness or tenderness to your extremities? No. Any recent urinary symptoms? No frequency, dysuria or pain with uri pain with ur urination, mm -hmm. urgency to urinate, blood in urine, um, excessive urination. No. You're not waking up in the middle of the night multiple times to urinate. No. Um, do you have any recent urinary tra tract infections? No. Do you have history of kidney infections or kidney stones? Mm -hmm. um, any recent suprapubic pain, ureter alcoholic, or incontinence? No. Right. And what, at what
what age did you start your menstrual cycle? I was 12. And since then it's been regular and same frequency? Yeah. Um, no increased bleeding recently? Mm -hmm. Is there any bleeding in between periods? No. Or after sex? No. Um, and your last menstrual period was last week? Yeah. Um, any significant abnormal cramping or pain associated with the? No. Um, have you had any recent vaginal discharge, itching, sores, lumps? Uh, any concern for STD? No. Have you ever had STD treatment? Mm -hmm. uh, have you ever been pregnant? No. Um, and you are on oral contraception. Um, and we talked about your sexual preference and function. Um, any recent muscle or joint pain? Just a little bit with recently, but. Okay. Um, any stiffness, arthritis, gout, or back aches? No. Do you have any neck pain or low back pain that is like systemic with your current symptoms? No. <laughs> um, with psychiatric questions, are you have you noticed yourself to be more nervous or tense or change in mood? No. Uh, do you have any history of depression? No. Any recent memory change? Do you have thoughts of harming yourself? No. And no plans of harming yourself? No. Have you received past counseling, psychotherapy, or psychiatric admissions? Mm -hmm. um, have you had any recent changes in your mood, attention, or speech? No. Change in orientation, memory, insight, or judgment? Mm -hmm. And you said no to recent headaches or dizziness or retigenous symptoms. Mm -hmm. um, any fainting or blacking out? No. Any focal weakness or numbness and tingling to certain extremities? Um, any recent tremors? Any history of seizures? Um, do you have history of anemia? No. Have you ever required a blood transfusion? Mm -hmm. Have you noticed yourself to like bruise more easily or bleed more easily recently? Mm -hmm. Any thyroid trouble? No. Any recent hot or cold intolerance? No. Any excessive sweating? Excessive thirst or hunger? No. And you said no to excessive urination? And any change in glove or shell? All right, that concludes all the questions.